SMG here. Welcome back to another Odd Ones Out reaction. This one is called My Thoughts on Reality Shifting. So, hey, yo, let's get into this. Make sure you watch the original video. Subscribe to Odd Ones Out. Make sure you like this video. Subscribe, ring the bell, and share on all that good jazz. Let's get it in three, two, one. Let's go. I understand that there are things that I don't understand. For example, theoretical physics or how to make friends. But I do know I know how to make friends. I have friends. That vaccines work and listening to people Coronavirus to is admittedly a guilty pleasure of mine. Whether it's conspiracy theories or horoscopes, I love watching people pour their heart into something they genuinely believe in only for me to go, I disagree. But please continue. There are some beliefs that I don't agree with, but are absolutely <sighs> fine to believe in, like thinking bucket hats look good on someone. But I think we can all agree mm. that some beliefs can be incredibly damaging. My religion is against dogs. As a whole, like the anti-vaxxers or racists. Wow. So I discovered a new. Oh trend. no! Not, sure not racist. Kids being kids or a mentally damaging belief system, but I'm still gonna talk about it and explain to my audience the importance of critical. Is that Harry Potter? Red flags and dangerous beliefs. So what am I talking about? I unfortunately fell down a rabbit hole and discovered a community of mostly kids on a phone application called TikTok doing something. No, not TikTok. Shifting. This, by the way, is not a small community of like 20 people. There are amino groups with thousands of members, videos with hundreds of thousands of views, and they have their own acronyms. O-M-G. Reality shifting stems from the belief in... <laughs> oh. Universe, my. Which, fucking I God. Honest, I'm not completely sold on that idea to begin with. You say that Schrodinger's cat is both alive and dead, but cats have nine lives. So are 4.5 cats dead? How is a cat nah. half dead? Either way, someone It's dogs that are going to have to die, I guess. said that every decision you've ever made has caused the universe to copy itself and create a new reality where you made the different decision. I had cereal for breakfast this morning. Oh boy. And somewhere there's a reality where I ate my hamster for breakfast. Whoa! No, 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 no. Every time I scratch my butt that and somewhere thick. there's a James with better manners. So times that Woo! people make thick decisions butt. every day. Plus the decisions made by like dogs and jellyfish, right? Those count, I think. And we get maybe infinity total realities. If you've seen Endgame, you know what I'm talking about. The reality shifting community says that since there are infinite realities, then there's a reality where GameStop stock is incredibly low, or that COVID. Oh God. Happen. Or perhaps there's even a reality out there. Who? Where Hogwarts is real and a messenger owl just <gasps> yes! stop your acceptance letter and through the right meditation, I want an acceptance letter. I want Hogwarts to be real. Reality, I'm kidding. Your CR for short to your Hogwarts desired reality, your DR, and for some so much good realities, reason, maybe Smash Hogwarts Ultimate can be real. One shiftable destination location. But obviously, it's not just Hogwarts. Any fictional universe is fair game. You could go to the Hunger Games or Lord go of the Rings. Or and Dark Crystal. Though, a lot of bad things happen there. And since all logic is thrown out the window, I want the Smash. Soon, an anime reality Ed, Ed, and Eddie. Destinations. Because oh my God, anime! Thing, it's that there are some universes that are just 24 drawings a second. So because there are allegedly infinite realities, people will write down what they want their desired reality to be, and this is called a script. It's funny, you know, normally scripts are made to tell mm -hmm. fictional stories, but these people think that what they write down will be 100% real. And you can make a script of whatever you want. You can say, I want to shift to Hogwarts and be in a relationship with Draco Malfoy. What? Uh, I mean, not, not me. This is just an example. <laughs> now listen, you're a smart kid, okay? But don't, you know, don't, to don't do it with the actor, because that's, uh, that's shipping works. real people, and if don't do that. That's bad. If you different realities, then that's great, and I see no problem with it. Is what I would say in a different reality, but in this reality, I have a lot of questions. If you can shift your consciousness into a different version of you... What happens to the alternate reality you's consciousness? You're just taking over someone else's body. This other you had a life and a family, unless that, you're going to a YA fantasy novel. But and you just don't steal, over just stealing body. your brain or whatever. A you in an alternate He's got a switch. Like, I want to live in a reality where there's a pandemic and I'm sadder. 
and then they shifted here. What happens to your consciousness? You don't trade. The reality shifting community says that when you shift, you leave behind a clone of yourself. Wow. Obviously. So, when so there's a shift, clone of me? There's someone's Please tell me there's a there's another SMG before. in this house. What about the realities where one of you had waffles for breakfast and the other had pancakes? Both of these yous are pretty much the exact same. So then both of you will want to reality shift to the exact same Harry Potter reality. Do you have to share a body with the other yous that have shifted to the same reality? Are you telling me that Voldemort and any what? fictional villain is Expect real? Expect the Patronum. Atlas didn't get turned to dust when Thanos snapped. If anyone Thanos could shift, are you telling oh my me God. There's a chance that Voldemort could download TikTok and reality shift here? If you go to Hogwarts, you're Bruh. bringing Voldemort right to us. How can there be a reality where magic is real? Sure, I don't know how parallel universes work. But they're parallel, so the laws of physics should still be the same, right? But James, I know that reality shifting makes no sense and is impossible, but then why do so many people claim to have shifted? Because they're dreaming. <laughs> shifting happens when you fall asleep, and if you fill your subconscious with things from your desired reality... But yeah, he wants to be Harry Potter that much. Hogwarts, Something about this trend doesn't sit right with me. A lot of the reality shifting TikToks were done by kids. And kids, as you know, can get really obsessed yeah. in the fandom and do some cringy stuff. If these kids were making fan fiction and writing themselves on a date with Bakugo, that would be totally fine. Healthy even. And ba right? even if Bakugo. Even if out said, I love Harry Potter so much that I want to manipulate my dreams to be about him. That would be fine too, but mm -hmm. something about actually believing that Whoa, you're rainbow that seizures. Universe, I don't know. That level of obsession just feels unhealthy, my guy. And also, my guy. Ago, he's fine. <laughs> the problem with reality shifting and actually conspiracy Baku is kind of hot. Let's be honest. They tend to be based on factual evidence when they're entirely a pseudoscience. You start off with a scientific idea, multiple realities, and then you make up whatever you want and use what the scientists have said about multiple realities as proof. Even though no scientist has said anything about being able to move your consciousness Wait, is that Miss Frizzle? I didn't even notice. Of yourself behind when you reality shift. That that is Miss Frizzle. Universes exist. I've seen people in videos say that they've done research on reality shifting. But I feel confident in saying you didn't get a degree in quantum physics. I want you to cite your sources and show me the studies because research isn't just believing what other people said on TikTok. These like Parappa the Rapper, I gotta to believe! Reality shifting in pretty manipulative ways, saying that if you didn't shift, it's because you didn't believe hard enough. When you get these doubts and say, oh, I can't shift, I don't even know if it's real anymore at this point, try and ask yourself after, but what if it's real? What if I can shift? You want to find out, do you? I get it. Harry Potter is a cool world. That's why mm -hmm. they made a whole theme park about it. Who wouldn't want to? The, yeah, the Wizarding World. world yeah, and it's in awesome. A castle with a bunch of soft British boys, and also magic or whatever. I want to be British. So be I'm Canadian, sadly. Information. I've watched hours of flat earthers and anti-vaxxers talk about their beliefs, and these people get their information from not clickbait, sources, and they end up pushing more fake information online. So much fake an shit. Echo chamber that warps their worldview. I don't want kids watching these TikToks or going on Amino and essentially get lied to. Um, and said Amino this too. Is how the world works. I'm hoping that all of these people will look back at themselves in ten years and go. Yeesh, I can't believe I was so obsessed about a thing. I literally tried to astral project myself across the multiverse. Right, Bakugo? I know that this reality can suck <laughs> what? sometimes. What? Oh my god, right so much stuff with Bakugo. Up. Like, seriously? But like it or not, this is the one reality we get. A lot of things may be out of your control, but according to theoretical physics, we make a lot of choices. And all we do, let's be real. down different paths. So what you need to do is not give up on this reality for a literal fictitious one, but instead to make choices that will make this current reality your desired reality. Thank you all for coming to my TED Talk. Who TED Talk? Drop out, of a, out of a muggle. Who wouldn't want to drop out of a muggle? <laughs> all about muggles, huh? Who wouldn't want to drop out of a out of a muggle? Out of a out of a. Who wouldn't want to drop out of a? Who wouldn't want Is this to drop those bloopers? Out of a public school? Yeah, these are bloopers. <laughs> who wouldn't want to drop out of a, Who wouldn't want to drop out of a Who wouldn't want to drop out of a muggle public school? Who wouldn't want to drop out of Who wouldn't want to drop out of a muggle public school and live in a castle with a bunch of soft British boys?
Also magic or whatever. There you go. You got it. Drop out of a muggle public school. Muggle public school is such a tongue twister. Oh my god. Who wouldn't want to drop out of a public school? Out of a public school. Muggle public school. school? Who wouldn't want to drop out of a public school? Who wouldn't want to drop out of a public school? Who wouldn't want to Okay, there's still 10 seconds left. Who wouldn't want to drop out of a Who wouldn't want to drop out of a Oh my fucking god. Public school and live in a castle. Oh my god. Exactly. Exactly. Anyways, guys, yeah, make sure you watch the original video, subscribe to Odd Ones Out. Make sure you like this video, subscribe, ring the bell, share, and all the good jazz. This is a really good one, let's be real. It was really good. And uh yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. There, guys. Thanks for watching. Deuces.